How many of us are parents or grandparents? Well, I shouldn't have raised my hand. But <laughs> you get the idea. Um, isn't there something so marvelous and fulfilling about seeing our kids play, seeing them giggle, seeing them just have that moment of happiness? Sometimes it might not be our happiness, like when my son microwaved my iPhone. Um, not a happy moment. Or when he took a full pack of Oreos, licked the filling, and then gave the rest to my dog to finish. That was not a happy moment. But, you know, in reality, happiness is a wonderful thing. And we see it in our children um, when they're smaller. Don't you ever reminisce about, you know, the good old days when we didn't have to worry about the next business meeting, uh, meeting deadlines, paying our bills. That was a wonderful time. I know I think about it all the time. And now, as the new parent educator at the Parenting Resource Center, I'm involved with a wide array of people. I go from um, working with the inmates at Freeborn and Mauer County. I work at um, CTS, the Workforce Center, um, Riverland. So I'm surrounded by people who all encounter different problems. And I remember one mom who had her daughter taken away by DHS. And um, it, was, it was a touching um, experience to be able to connect with her and you know, bring new ideas and have her talk to me. Because um, she once stated, you know, I become involved in my problems so much and so do other people that sometimes I don't just want to talk about my problem. I want to talk about other problems. I want to see you know, what other people are doing. And then I asked her, well, how do you take care of yourself? And there was probably a three minute pause and she said, I don't know. So I said, you know, sometimes we become so involved in doing things, everything we do is to meet a goal. Think about it, you know, working. To, um, our goal there is to meet our bills. Um, we might be working towards projects. They're all to meet some sort of goal. But do we really take the time to play? So what is play? Play is doing something because it's fun and not to achieve a goal. Oftentimes, we want our children to learn everything from us, you know, um, our way of thinking, our way of doing things, our approach to things. But I don't think we ever really take the time to stop and learn from them. Um, what do we get from playing? Playing helps us connect to others. It helps us foster creativity, flexibility, and learning. It's the antidote to loneliness, isolation, anxiety, and depression. It teaches us perseverance. It creates happiness. And it develops our social skills. Just think about a little one going to daycare. They're learning their social skills from playing. It teaches us cooperation with others. It teaches us how to share. I know that's something I'm struggling with at home, teaching my little one how to share. But it, we're going to get there, and it's going to teach them cooperation, putting in your effort to meet a big goal. And it can also heal emotional wounds. Um, once we're done playing, the problem will probably still be there. But by playing, it'll at least give us a fresh start, a fresh mentality to once again do or work towards um, solving our problems. So what do we feel when we play? We might feel involvement. We might feel delight. We might feel clarity, confidence, serenity, timeliness, and motivation. Sometimes our best ideas come from playing. So here's the dare. I dare each and every one of you to go home and make a list. Make a list of three things you could do endlessly. For me, it's, you know, making a cup of coffee or a cup of tea and, you know, watching Netflix. That's what I like to do. I like reading and I like being outside. Next, carve time into your schedule. Playing and taking care of yourself is just as important as going to the next business meeting, attending your next appointment. Make time for yourself. The last part is to play well with others. Do you like doing yoga? And is there someone you could do yoga with? 
just to get that fulfillment and say, you know, I enjoy doing this with one of my good friends. Will you take a different approach, learn from your children, and dare to play? Thank you. <laughs>